Hi, this is Raina. Welcome to my channel. Today we will learn how to crochet a beautiful fall maple leaf. I will show you how to crochet the smaller red leaf and uh, the pattern for the bigger, more intricate uh, green leaf you will find on my blog. So you are welcome to try that one as well. And uh, let's make the new leaf orange. We will start with slip knot. As you see, I'm using a crochet hook size B, 2.25 millimeters, and crochet thread number three, size three. So first we are going to chain 16. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. We're going to single stitch in second chain from hook. So this one. And then single stitch in each chain. Total, uh, you'll get 14 single stitches. One, two, three, four, Okay, I'm down to 13, 14, and in the last chain, we're going to single stitch three times. One, two, and three. And then continue on the other side of the chain. Single stitch again, 14 in each chain on this side. One, Two, three. When you're done with 14 uh, single stitches on this mm -hmm. side, chain one and turn. We're going to start our second row here. Uh, we are going to skip the first single stitch. So this was the chain we made, and this is the first stitch we're going to skip. And we are going to single stitch in back loops now only, which is the here. And this way we're going to single stitch 14 back loops. After 14 pack loop single stitches, we've reached to the point where um, we made three single stitches uh, on our last row. And we are now going to uh, again crochet three single stitches in that middle one, which is that one, and do it through the both loops, not only back loop. This one, both loops. So three single stitches in here. And now keep single stitches in back back loops and make 12. One, two, three. I'm done with my 12 back loop single stitches. And here we're going to chain one turn starting our uh, row number three and again skip first single stitch this is the chain this is the first stitch we're skipping and start single stitching in back loops into the next 
and do 12 single stitches here. After 12 stitches, I've reached again the middle of the three stitches uh, from the uh, previous row. And I'm doing the same three single stitches in both loops into that middle one here. So three single stitches through both loops uh, here. Now keep single stitching in back loops and this time single stitch 13. After 13 uh, back loop single stitches, we are going to chain one, turn, and start our row number four. Again, skip the first single stitch, so, so this one, and single stitch in back loop of the next one. And on the fourth row, we are going to first single stitch 13 back loop single stitches. Again, we have reached the middle single stitch of previous row where we single stitch three times in one. And again, both loops, single stitch three in here. Okay, now keep working back loops and single stitch now 11. After 11 back loop single stitches, chain one, turn, starting our row number five, skip the first single stitch, this one, start back loop single stitches into the next, and crochet 11 single stitches. After 11 stitches, single stitch both loops three times into the same continue on the other side back loops only and 12 single stitches after 12 chain one turn skip the first single stitch single stitch back loops to the next. This is our row number six. And we're going to do 12 stitches first. After 12, again, single stitch through both loops three times. One, two, three. Continue back loops only. And now Crochet 10. After 10, chain one, turn, start row number seven, skip first single stitch, single stitch back loops, and first make 10 stitches. After 10, single stitch through both loops three times into the same, two, three, continue back loops, and now crochet 11 times. After 11 stitches, chain one, turn, this is now our row number eight. Skip first stitch, single stitch back loops, and to 11, two, three. After 11 stitches here, find the middle stitch again, single stitch through both loops and this time we're going to single stitch five times one two three four 
five. We need some extra stitches here on this row. Then keep uh, single stitching in back loops nine times. One, two, three. After nine back loop stitches, we are now ready to start the side part of the leaf. For that, chain five, three, four, five. Okay, so chain five, turn, single stitch into the third chain from the hook. One, two, three. To the fourth and into the fifth. After three single stitches into that five chain uh, stitches, keep uh, single stitching in back loops and two five more. One, two. Three, four, five. Now chain one and turn. Start a new row, skip the first stitch, this one here, and single stitch in back loops seven times. After seven single stitches, chain four, two, three, four, turn, single stitch in third chain from hook, one, two, three, and um, two, eight more single stitches, total of nine here. four and when you finish nine single stitches single stitch one more and um, just find a space here at the end of that last row single stitch into it here and now slip stitch into the edge of the main leaf the back loop just slip stitch once. Chain one and turn. So now this is uh, going to be my row number 11. Skip first stitch, this one, and single stitch 10 back loops. Two, three, after 10 back loop stitches, chain four, two, three, four, turn, single stitch into the third chain from the hook, and do 11 more single stitches, total 12. After 12, Single stitch one more, and again find a space here in that previous row. I'll just do that single stitch and finish with a slip stitch into the back loop of main leaf. Chain, turn, skip first stitch. Start our row number 12 and do 11 back loop stitches. And this is where we are going to start to decrease the second leaf part. So after um, 11, turn. Uh, chain one, skip first 
first and do 10 back loop stitches. After 10 back loop stitches, do one more single stitch into this end part of the previous row and slip stitch in a back loop of main leaf. Chain one and turn, starting our row number 13. Skip first and single stitch nine back loops. After nine stitches here, chain one, turn, skip first stitch, this one, and single stitch back loops eight times. After eight, single stitch one more time into this end part here of the previous row, slip stitch into the main leaf, back loop, and we're done with the second part of the side leaf. Chain one and turn. Starting row number 14, skip first stitch, this one, back loops again only, and do seven. After seven stitches, chain four, two, three, four, turn, single stitch into the third, and now do eight more single stitches, total of nine. After nine stitches, single stitch one more time into the end part of the previous row and slip stitch into the main leaf. Find the next stitch at back loop here. Chain one, turn, Start row number 15, skip first stitch, do back loops, and 10 this time. After 10 back loop stitches, chain four, two, three, four, turn, single stitch into the third chain from hook. and do 11 more single stitches, total of 12. After 12 stitches, do one more into the end part here, and find the next stitch on main leaf, slip stitch into the back loop, chain one and turn, start row 16, skip first stitch, back loop single stitches, 11. After 11, this is again the decreasing part, chain one, turn, skip the first stitch, do back loops 10 times. After 10 stitches, do one more into this part here. And again, slip stitch into the main leaf, find the next stitch, back loop, slip through. Chain one, turn, start the last row of this part here, 17. Skip first, back loops, nine. After nine, chain, turn your work, 
skip first stitch back loops and do eight two three four five six seven eight now one more stitch into that end part here and now continue the back loops of the main leaf here's the first one the next one single stitch back loops 12 times See, we're going to continue with the other side of the leaf. It all works in one piece, which is really convenient. And after 12 back loop stitches across the edge of the main leaf other side, you can start the, start the other side, which was the row number nine, and started with five chains. Eight back loop stitches. Seven. Ten. Twelve. Eleven. Ten. Plus one. Eight. Seven. Nine.
ten. Eleven. Nine. Eight. So I finished my last row of the second half of the leaf. So almost done all we have to do now is to chain 14 for the stem Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, 11 12 13 14 and um, single stitch into the third from the hook, so chain, and into each next, so you'll have 12 single stitches here. I finished uh, single stitches of my stem, 12, and I'm going to finish just slip stitching into the beginning part here, and um, ready to cut off the thread. Just pull it through, fasten, and then of course weave it in with a needle. Here we go. We made orange leaf. Doesn't it look really beautiful? Especially with these other guys here. It's gonna look better without the thread ends, of course. So this is today's project. Um, thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you have any questions. I'm happy to help. Happy crocheting.